WTFNN. Headline news update. Good morning, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien, coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida, 9 a.m. Eastern Time, Wednesday morning, 30 minutes to go until the opening bell, and we got markets in positive territory. S&P futures up eight points right now, or about a quarter percent, trading at 32.86. Dow futures up 128 points, or about almost half a percent, trading 28,838. NASDAQ futures positive by 34, or almost four-tenths percent in the green, trading 91.39. We'll start things off this morning, jump over to the VIX as the market charges higher. The VIX reaching actually a price level this morning. Did we get a 14 handle? We did, 14.94 at 8 a.m., currently a bit above that level at 15.68. Let's jump over to the indices. We'll start things off with the Dow. You see the rise from the close yesterday to back things up. There is on the chart 4 p.m. Eastern time. We close at around 28,700. We're now right near pre-market highs of 28,839. S&P 500 trading at 3,286. We're actually briefly above 3,290, just about in the last two hours. NASDAQ 100 trading at 91.40. We got Apple earnings after the bell last night. You see the acceleration higher on the futures. We'll get into those in a moment as Apple crushes their earnings and trades more than 2% higher so far this morning. Crude oil, $53.74. A little bit of volatility this morning in crude. We get EIA numbers at 10.30 this morning, an hour and a half from right now. There's your gold contract, 15.69. Off of the lows we got last night of 15.62. And the euro US dollar under 110 at 109.96. I mentioned it, Apple earnings last night after the bell, rising as iPhone sales smash expectations. Getting into the numbers, earnings 499 versus 455, revenue 91.8 versus 88.5, and almost all of that beat in iPhone revenue, almost 56 billion versus 51.62. Other stocks out there making moves. GE trading higher after earnings top expectations. Free cash flow at $2.3 billion seems to be a big number for them hitting this morning. And you got Boeing earnings out as well this morning. First annual loss in more than two decades, but Boeing shares trading higher. We'll jump over to some of those. There is Boeing looking to open at 326, closed yesterday about 316. We covered Apple, closed yesterday at 317.69, up at 323.66. And GE closed at 1173, up almost a dollar at 1261. Stay tuned, folks. Larry Pesavento coming up. Don't forget his webinar tonight, 4 p.m. Sign up for it on the front page of TFNN.com. Stay tuned, folks. Larry Pesavento coming up with Trade What You See right now. We'll be right back.